Okay, I wanted to put this video together real quick. Um, you know, I just made this urinal here. And, uh, you know, it's pretty simple business. You just step up, take care of your business. And uh, this, is a, this is a five gallon bucket here. Old gas can that I had. Uh, you know, after, after it gets about three gallons in it, I'll probably take it out and empty it probably about once a week. And I got me a little splash guard down here. And so that's real simple. And here's the composting toilet, and this is just sphagnum peat moss in there. I haven't done any business or anything. It's just sphagnum peat moss. But I've got the urine, uh, the urine diverter here. And I've got a toilet seat for this. It's down at uh, Ladonia, Texas. Uh, my sister's got some land down there. I've I built a shower and a toilet down there. I'm gonna bring that toilet seat back next time, cause my toilet, my bath, my uh, my toilet, my bathroom's all screwed up. Doesn't really work right, so I built this. And there's really no smell to it. It uh, doesn't smell like doo doo. It just smells like um, you know a real earthy smell. And here's some sphagnum peat moss right here. You know you cover up when you're done there. And uh, I put my toilet paper here. Again, this is sphagnum peat moss in here. Um, because if, if I put the toilet paper in the toilet, it just it builds up way too fast. Otherwise, this right here will last me oh, about 15 days. Just I'm just one person. Tell me about 15 days. Put the lid on it. Take it outside. Let it set for about a month. Then empty it out. And that's my uh, little old composting toilet. You know, I had to get the. I wanted to make the urinal because otherwise I have to empty this thing about really almost every day or you know every other day anyway so it's kind of pain in the ass so then i'll just urine you know urinate in here piss whatever you want to call it uh that's about it all right happy hunting y'all